Okay, I'm back, and I got another topic I want to talk about regarding uh, music. <clears throat> now, this is regarding how to practice the guitar. Uh, a lot of times, people waste time when they're practicing because they're, they're, they don't have an agenda. They don't have a plan. So what I would suggest to beginning guitarists is to write down your practice schedule. Um, you know, if you could put aside 30 minutes, that's great. That's great. If you can put aside even more, that's even better. Um, definitely sit down and you want to plot out, plot out your practice schedule. So for example, what I would do is first I would do warm up exercises, right? For my picking, for my right hand and for my left hand. And I do these different exercises, you can find them on YouTube. They're all over, maybe I'll post a couple of them that I like to use. Uh, then next, for example, I would work on my chords. And I would learn chords that I don't, that I don't, I don't know, and I would practice those. Uh, you know, your bar chord, chords, your minor sevens, and your extended chords, thirteens and elevens. You know, jazz chords. And then next, maybe I would work on my scales. Okay, so I would work on my major scale and and all the uh, the, the modes, Dorian and Phrygian, things like that. Uh, if you already know those, then learn a scale that you're not familiar with, like a jazz scale, you know. Uh, learn the harmonic minor scale or diminished scale. Uh, the next, maybe I would maybe work on a song, a song that I want to learn. I start, uh, you know, listening to the song and trying to learn the chords. Um, and maybe lastly, it would be like the fun part for me is uh, to work on some riffs, you know, come up with original riffs or some solos or write a song. Um, and I found that was the most productive use of, of time when uh, practicing the guitar. Because I remember I would pick up the guitar with good intentions and I want to practice, but I would automatically start playing the things I already knew. So, which means I didn't really progress. I perfected those things already, and I just kept repeating them over. And I wasn't really adding anything new to my uh, playing. And then I started reading and, and uh, articles by other uh, guitar players, and that's when they said and suggested that we should sit down and write out our uh, agenda, our practice uh, regimen so I mean you can you don't have to do it completely like that it's not uh, it may not work for everybody you may want to start off small maybe you know go ahead and play the fun stuff you already know and then we're add maybe you know working on scales I don't know do that for 15 minutes and then gradually you'll start to add more things into your practice schedule. And then you'll, you'll be able to uh, move on from the stuff that was hard to, and then it becomes easy and then you can add even add more things to your, to your practice. So that's a quick video on the correct way to practice. Um, again, utilize your time wisely. I know we can't spend eight hours a day with the guitar. Maybe you could. Uh, as we get older, it becomes a little bit harder, so we have to make good use of our time, and we do have uh, a chance to sit down with our instrument. So I would suggest before you do any of that, sit down and plot out your plan of attack, because that's going to make your practice schedule go really, uh, be really efficient and you're going to make a lot of improvements with your playing. Okay, thank you again. I appreciate the support and all the new subscribers. And uh, like the video if you like it. And
and um, I don't know, look forward to some more um, videos like this. Thank you.